It's episode 5 of Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Wow, what does that mean? Well, very soon in tomorrow's episode, we'll get Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Uh, that will be coming out in tomorrow's episode. Well, tomorrow, as I'm recording this, because it's Friday, and one more episode for Saturday, which will be. I will worry with Age of Calamity. Wow, I can't believe you got it already. So of course, going into the past, I will worry. With. If you're watching this in the future, that means you can watch it up in the eye up here on that playlist. If you're watching this in the future, so I will worry. Is it's time in well. Tomorrow, in tomorrow's video. Uh, but before then, let's go into episode five of of Breath of the Wild right now. Well, this is where we left off in the Shrine of Resurrection. So uh, right now we need a whole get up to uh, the. Um, the old church. And so let's head over there right now. It's gonna be awesome. It's episode five, which is amazing. Let's go. Also, we'll probably more celebrate eventually once we receive our master sword. I'm putting this back out. Let's dance and mess the swords. Um, bam, bam, bam. Nice. Grabbing some uh, arrows there from the chest, and we get us. Traveler's bow, which is uh, our second traveler's bow there. Brilliant. And let's uh, go over here and talk to the statue. And grab ourselves our fourth heart. Boom. Our fourth heart. Come on, statue. Give us something good. Our four spirit orbs. Yes, I know. I see that. Our heart container. Brilliant. Yes. There we go. All four gone. And bringing the heart container down. And giving us. Giving us. Four hearts. Nice. I had to move the camera over to the uh, right here and I'll pop it back. There we go, there's the old man. We need to jump up there now. Let's go. Climb, 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 all the way up, all the way up, all the way up. I didn't realise how slow it actually it takes to climb. So I am that for me. But lucky for you, it doesn't take too long to take to it up. And here we are, the old man. Shut up for a second so you can uh, listen to this cutscene. <laughs> well done there, young one. Now then, the time has come to show you who I truly am. I was King Rome Bosphoramus Hyrule. I was the last leader of Hyrule. A kingdom which no longer exists. <sighs> Oh. 
The Great Calamity was merciless. It devastated everything in its path, lo, a century ago. It was then that my life was taken away from me. And since that time, here I have remained in spirit form. I did not think it wise to overwhelm you while your memory was still fragile. So rather than that, I thought it best to assume a temporary form. Forgive me. I think you are now ready. Ready to hear what happened 100 years ago. To know Calamity Ganon's true form, one must know the story from an age long past. The Demon King was born into this kingdom, but his transformation into malice created the horror you see now. Stories of Ganon were passed from generation to generation in the form of legends and fairy tales. But there was also a prophecy. The signs of a resurrection of Calamity Ganon are clear, and the power to oppose it lies dormant beneath the ground. We decided to heed the prophecy and began excavating large areas of land. It wasn't long before we discovered several ancient relics made by the hands of our distant ancestors. These relics, the Divine Beasts, were giant machines piloted by warriors. We also found the Guardians, an army of mechanical soldiers who fought autonomously. This coincided with ancient legends oft repeated throughout our land. We also learned of a princess with a sacred power, and her appointed knight chosen by the sword that seals the darkness. It was they who sealed Ganon away using the power of these ancient relics. One hundred years ago, there was a princess set to inherit a sacred power, and a skilled knight at her side. It was clear that we must follow our ancestors' path. We selected four skilled individuals from across Hyrule and tasked them with the duty of piloting the Divine Beasts. With the Princess as their commander, we dubbed these pilots Champions, a name that would solidify their unique bond. The Princess, her appointed knight, and the rest of the Champions were on the brink of sealing away Ganon. But nay. Ganon was cunning, and he responded with a plan beyond our imagining. He appeared from deep below Hyrule Castle, seized control of the Guardians and the Divine Beasts. Us. The champions lost their lives, those residing in the castle as well. The appointed knight gravely collapsed while defending the princess. And thus, the kingdom of Hyrule was devastated absolutely by Calamity Ganon. However, the princess survived to face Ganon alone. Link, you are our final hope. The fate of Hyrule rests with you. That princess was my own daughter, my dear Zelda. And the courageous knight who protected her right up to the very end. That night was none other than you, Link. You fought valiantly when your fate took an unfortunate turn. And then you were taken to the Shrine of Resurrection. Here you now stand, revitalized 100 years later. The words of guidance you have been hearing since your awakening are from Princess Zelda herself. Even now, 
as she works to restrain Ganon from within Hyrule Castle. She calls out for your help. However, my daughter's power will soon be exhausted. Once that happens, Ganon will freely regenerate himself, and nothing will stop him from consuming our land. Considering that I could not save my own kingdom, I have no right to ask this of you, Link. But I am powerless here. You must save her, my daughter, and do whatever it takes to annihilate Ganon. Somehow, Ganon has maintained control over all four divine beasts, as well as those guardians swarming around Hyrule Castle. I believe it would be quite reckless for you to head directly to the castle at this point. I suggest that you make your way east out to one of the villages in the wilderness. Follow the road out to Kakariko village. There you will find the elder Impa. She will tell you more about the path that lies ahead. Consult the map on your Shika slate for the precise location of Kakariko village. Make your way past the twin summits of the dueling peaks. From there, follow the road as it proceeds north. Oh, turns out the old man is actually the king, or, or the dead king of Hyrule. And that will lead into uh, Hyrule uh, Warriors Age of Calamity tomorrow, in tomorrow's episode. The very first episode of I will worry is, and that will lead into that. What an amazing uh, journey it's going to be for Hyrule Warriors and the rest of Breath of the Wild, which uh, will be episode 6 uh, next week. Uh, so, of course, that is our the Dead King there uh, dissipating. Soldier sort of bowl. So if you enjoy the rest of the, if you want to check out on the playlist uh, for Breath of the Wild and of course Age of Calamity, which will be up there ready for you to watch. Uh, so check those out, and uh, yeah, hopefully enjoy Age of Calamity tomorrow. I'm excited. Uh, hope you are. I'll be excited to get that up for you uh, tomorrow. See you over there.